This is a vibe table, so it'll just take the carton and shake it. Inside the Southwest Portland lab, engineers are shaking things up a bit. It's supposed to replicate a box bouncing around the back end of a shipping container in a pickup truck. They're testing out a much more earth-friendly alternative to plastic and styrofoam packaging. Packaging made out of paper. This is e-flute. They've specially designed cardboard and other paper-based packaging so that it can be shaken, dropped, and even exposed to cold and moisture, but still perform as good or better than its plastic counterpart. But you can rep replicate that with paper as well. In fact, you can surpass the performance of plastics with the right papers. The company is called Billarud Korshnus. If you haven't heard the name yet, you likely will someday soon. That's because the international company has created not only the latest in biodegradable packaging, it claims to have created the world's first 100% recyclable and biodegradable paper bottle for carbonated beverages. The company is looking to push the envelope. That's right, pretty soon you may be sipping down your soda or beer from one of these. This video shows how the paper bottles are made and tested. Of course, this is just a prototype, but so far, so good. They've been able to have the bottle hold carbonation and the pressure that it takes, and that's quite a bit of engineering to do that. And consider this, an estimated 480 billion plastic bottles are produced every year. And while some end up in the recycling bin, many end up in our landfills. And then there's the infamous Great Pacific Plastic Patch out in the ocean. Scientists now estimate the plastic mess to be the size of Texas, if not larger. If you can replace that plastic bottle with a fiber-based bottle, that would be uh, 80 to 100 percent recyclable. That would be a, a massive victory. As for any criticism, the practice means a lot more trees being cut down. The company's response. So for every tree that we take out, we plant three. A sustainable and renewable option to something many of us buy and toss every day. In Southwest Portland, Keeley Chalmers, KGW News.